Lagodo Romagnolo, Romagnol water dog, country of origin, Italy. From hunter to truffle seeker, the Lagodo Romagnolo, or Romagnolo water dog, descends from Italian dogs intended for retrieving game in the water. Moreover, its name means in Italian, dog of the lakes of Romagna, which translates very well its initial use, as well as the region of northern Italy from which lives comes, Romagna. It was used at least from the Italian Renaissance for this task, especially in the marshes and lagoons present in its native region. In addition to keeping company with his masters and watching over their homes, he had no equal in going to retrieve ducks that had been killed and were lying in the water. It is therefore in a way the Italian equivalent of the Spanish water dog, or the Irish water spaniel. Moreover, many specialists argue that the Lagodo Romagnolo is the oldest of the breeds of game retriever dogs and that it is the distant ancestor of many more recent breeds, such as the Golden Retriever, the Portuguese Water, or the Poodle. It would also be one of the oldest Italian dog breeds. The first trace of Lagodo Romagnolo. The first trace of an animal resembling him dates from the 15th century, and more precisely from 1474, on a fresco named Perret dell'Incontro, painted by the Italian Andrea Montegna. It was also described by the philosopher Erasmus, 1466 to 1536, and appeared in some works by the engraver Marcantonio Ramondi, 1480 to 1534. Later, during the 18th century, the famous naturalist Carl von Linné, 1707 to 1778, described a Mediterranean water dog strongly resembling the Romagnol water dog. Towards the end of the 19th century, a large part of the marshes of the region was drained to serve as cultivable land, so that the Lagodo Romagnolo was left without work. However, farmers and other landowners very quickly discovered in him a great talent for looking for truffles, these mushrooms that are very popular in the world of gastronomy. Indeed, the excellent sense of smell of this dog, combined with its thick coat protecting it from branches, brambles and other herbs, made it very efficient. This change of use also implied certain modifications of the traits of the breed, its primitive hunting instinct gradually weakened, while it developed an unfailing concentration very useful for the search for truffles. These two evolutions combined to ensure that he was not distracted by game while he was working. Truffles Search However, the number of people dedicated to the search for truffles was much lower than that of those who practiced hunting. Also, the population of the breed decreased drastically, so much so that by the middle of the 20th century, there were only a handful of Lagodi left. Also, truffle seekers weren't really interested in developing a full-fledged breed. As long as the dog was good at performing its task, that was fine with them. As a result, a certain relaxation appeared at the beginning of the 20th century concerning the selection of this dog, and various unthoughtful crosses with other breeds were undertaken. The rescue and spread of the breed during the 20th century. In the 70s, some thought that the Lagodo Romagnolo had totally disappeared. There were, however, a few left in Italy, which passionate breeders took significant steps to preserve. The group was led by Quintino Toshi, a breeder and judge at the Ente Nazionale della Cinefilia Italiana ENCI, the canine organization of reference in the country. With the support of veterinarian Antonio Marciano and another Lagoto lover, Lodovico Babini, a breeding program was developed to save this dog from extinction. In 1988, they founded a breed club, the Club Italiano Lagoto and provided important work to allow the latter to develop again in good conditions. The work provided by this group was a success, and notably allowed the Romagnol water dog to be recognized by the ENCI in 1992. It then began to make itself known and spread abroad, particularly in Europe, France, Switzerland, Germany, Finland, Great Britain, etc., but also much further afield, such as in Australia and the United States. Although in some of these countries truffles are not as plentiful as in Romagna, the Lagodo has found its place with families as a watchdog and companion. It is also possible to come across it, although much more rarely, in rivers, as a game finder. International Canine Federation, FCI. The Fédération Sinologique Internationale, FCI, 
recognized the breed on a provisional basis in 1995. Ten years later, in 2005, it granted it full recognition. Faced with an expansion that became global, the Unione Mondiale dei Club Legoto Romagnolo, World Union of Clubs of Legoto Romagnolo, was born in 1997. Presided over by Dr. Giovanni Morsiani, it made it possible to preserve the original traits of the breed and to coordinate quality breeding programs around the world. American Kennel Club, AKC. It was also this same year that a breed club was founded in the United States, the Legoto Club of America. The American Kennel Club, AKC, accepted in 2001 to register the Legoto within its foundation stock service, prior to full recognition which occurred in 2015. The other reference organization in the United States, the United Kennel Club, UKC, recognized her for her part in 2006. On the Canadian side, the Legoto Romagnolo made its debut in 1999. The first subject imported into the country came from a famous Italian breeding named Farney. The same year, a very first breeding was created in Alberta. Others followed in particular in 2000 and 2004, respectively in Ontario and Nova Scotia. Even if these pioneer farms no longer exist today, they greatly contributed to the spread of the breed on Canadian territory. She was provisionally recognized in 2012 by the Canadian Kennel Club, CKC, then definitively in 2016. Finally, in the United Kingdom, the Romagnol Water Dog was accepted by the prestigious Kennel Club in 2000.